Every day, all over the world, people flock to flea markets, street vendors, and private homes to get their hands on the brands they love at unbelievable prices. Whether it is music, videos, or clothing, selling counterfeit products has become common practice. The majority of people understand counterfeits as economic or legal problems, and therefore don't consider it very important. What if counterfeits were not just an issue in the fashion or entertainment industry? What if counterfeits penetrated something more fundamental to our lives? What if the medications we purchased from our pharmacies was fake? Over 2,000 people die every day around the world from substandard and counterfeit medicine. These fake medications can contain antifreeze, heavy metals, chalk, washing powder, and even rat poison. Although most counterfeits don't cause deaths, they cause a range of other serious illnesses and fuel drug resistance strains of the diseases people are trying so hard to fight. In Africa, selling fake medications has become big business. An estimated third of the total trade of pharmaceuticals in Africa is believed to be counterfeit. This critical problem led Bright Simmons to invent M Pedigree. Established in Ghana in 2007, M Pedigree created an electronic resource system for Africa's under-resourced health sector. Through basic test messaging, using M Pedigree's unique mobile phone platform, consumers have the ability to query the origins of their medicines and to establish whether it is genuine or potentially a dangerous imitation. Fanska companies typically um, work together with us to serialize packs of medicines, which means they put on unique IDs on every pack of medicine. And when a consumer buys the medicine, they're able to instantly validate that pack by sending the unique ID on the medicine to a toll-free hotline, which is a simple phone number that is memorizable. And they get an instant response back, confirming that that particular pack of medicine is safe for them to use. For the consumer, the service is completely free in that they don't pay for the cost of the SMS. In just over six years, the MP degree system has expanded from Ghana into Nigeria, Kenya, and more recently, India. To date, over 10 million people have successfully used this system. With the collective efforts from legitimate pharmaceutical companies, telecom operators, and governments, MP degree has ensured that the sale of fake medicines has and will continue to decline. M Pedigree, another great idea, born in Africa.